going on empire builders welcome back to another episode if you're brand new to the empire builder family first and foremost welcome please like comment subscribe make sure to turn the notification bell on and drop a comment down below on today's video to enter in to win a free 25 dollar amazon gift card so guys today we're going to be sp specifically talking to you guys who are kind of just trying to make that first dollar on right line right make that first thousand dollars uh in e-commerce drop shipping online so right now i'm going to show you guys uh what I would do if I need to make a thousand dollars in sales real quick This is a strategy that I would find but if you're brand new to e-commerce Make sure you check out that sales funnel masterclass down below guys where I have more time with you Start devouring some of the amazing content on this channel already Because uh, this is what we talk about all day every single day sales funnels for e-commerce and not utilizing uh, Shopify or Amazon FBA at least to start. Okay, so there are three key things to make this work All right three simple steps offer funnel traffic offer funnel traffic offer funnel traffic right that's all you need to start making money in e-commerce okay offer what's the thing you're going to be selling what's the offer what makes you unique right the funnel right that's the sales funnel there's going to be links down in the description of this video you can download these funnels uh some of them these are not my seven figure uh, e commerce templates. Uh, if you want those, you have to join six figure funnels. Um, but you get some templates that I get, get you started, right? Get you started. And we're going to be sure I'm going to be showing you the one you can get down below in the description of this video. Just download one of those funnels um, for yourself. And then traffic, right? How do we start driving traffic to our funnels to start making money? So the first step is the offer, right? Where are we getting these products from, guys? All right. So there's two main places that I like to get products from, right? There's going to be Amazon where you're going to be able to utilize that quicker shipping times you're going to be able to utilize Aliexpress as well Okay, so Aliexpress basically um, is 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 uh, is trading companies usually um, Where they're kind of working with manufacturers directly in China and they sell us the products and they ship it from China The downside is longer shipping times with Amazon slower shipping time or uh, faster shipping times slow shipping times fast shipping times Take your pick, uh, pick your poison, all right? Your margin's gonna be better on AliExpress. So let's just type in fishing lures, guys, because you know I love them fishing lures. Uh, so I would type in right away, and, and the thing is, guys, what you, I don't wanna go dive deep, because I know a lot of you guys are just trying to make that first thousand dollars online, you just wanna taste it, what's it like? So what I typically recommend people do is don't come from a place of like product first, come from a place of market first, right? What does the market want, right? What? Can, how can I create an offer for people uh, instead of just like just trying to sell them a product and hoping something sticks, right? We're not in a game to test hundreds of products a day. We're not in that game. We're creating irresistible offers to get our customers buying from us instead of our competition, okay? Um, so if I'm going to sell fishing lures, what else does this market need? Like for example, this uh, this fishing lure right here. What? Well, Tim, let's go right. Um, let's just kind of filter this down a little bit. So I want to see uh, orders, right? What's already selling well here, right? What's selling well here? And you can see here, uh, 10,000 plus orders on this fishing uh, lure. This one has 9,000. I know this. I used to sell this thing like crazy. Um, so let's click into this guy. So uh, let me close this out. So here is a product. It has good sales volume. It costs two ninety eight. dollars um, Let's see if they offer uh, e-packet here. Uh, e-packet will add about a buck. So that will bring our total, where's the total, whatever, two ninety eight plus one oh seven. So close to uh, three, uh, four bucks there. So a little over. So that would be our cost there. So I'll look at that, right? Let's just select the quantity here for uh, 405. Oops, let me just select that and then it'll show us the price. So 405 for this uh, fishing bait right here. So that's great and all four bucks. We could probably what, what can we sell it for, right? Typically, just because I understand this market, it's important to understand your market. A little, you're not going to be really get more than ten dollars for a fishing lure, guys. Like unless that thing is like really high quality made. So four bucks for me, I'm like that seems a little steep for a fishing lure. I'm going to go look at other places. So I'll go on Amazon and type in fishing lure. And guess what pops up? <laughs> so you see these, these are sets. So this is a three set, it looks like. Here's one. Uh, a lot of these suppliers just sell directly from, uh, from uh, uh, they're, they're, they're already selling like in on Amazon as well. Uh, so some of these are sets, some of these are not. So let's look at, uh, let's look at, let's look at this one. This is the best seller here, so let's see. 
So similar design, it's, I know the technical details of these that are different. These are very different actually uh, fishing baits, but let's just use this for the sake of this as an example. So you can see here, uh, it depends on the one you pick, they're gonna be different prices. So $8.99 here and free shipping. So you might be thinking, well, Pete, like why would I charge you know $8.99 for a bait if I can just go $4 here? Uh, absolutely, you can do that and you can save that margin for yourself. So this is where you have options. If you're a better marketer, Right? If you already kind of understand marketing, I would sell this and just create a better offer, right? It's $8.99. What else can we bundle in this thing to not just sell the product, not the fishing lure, but like, like what else do they need? So for example, if we're just doing uh, fishing lure, right? Fishing lure, whoops, fishing lure. What else could they need? So a great place to look what else could they need is you scroll down to the frequently bought together. So it looks like they just want more fishing lures, most of these people, right? Right? Uh, oh, I love what these people did. You see this? A new model. They're kind of like, steal. they're going to get, guaranteed they're going to get in trouble for that. Uh, <laughs> they're kind of like stealing the... Um, the, uh, the bestseller highlight uh, just by putting it in their image, but uh, definitely against terms of service. But so I'll click into this one. Let's see this two pack here. So here's a two pack for $9.99, right? A lot cheaper, right? A lot cheaper. So you could see, uh, I like to look all through frequently. So I would like click into all these, see what the frequently bought together is, but mostly people are gonna want more fishing lures, okay? So this is where the nice part comes into play with uh, with AliExpress is you only pay this e-pack at one time. So if I click two, my price is seven, right? It's not, it's only charging me this price uh, uh, it's only charging me shipping one time, right? So three of them, I can get them for 10. Uh, four of them, I can get them for 12.99. So let me show you real quick. Let's change this back to ePacket, right? And we do quantity discounts on our funnel, right? And we'll get into that in a second. So one, one unit is 405. And I want to try and sell this for at least 997. Uh, I'll show you guys the strategy in a second. But I usually I always love to sell these in, uh, in quantity discounts. So I'll do one, two, four, six, and eight. Those are kind of the numbers I've always gone with and I've always had success with. So with the students of mine, um, it just you want to get people not buying one. You don't want people to buy one unit, okay? You want to maximize as much money as you can out of this. So one unit, our cost is $4.05. Our customer will pay $9.97. I'm not finalized on that pricing yet. Usually I like the three exit, but let's just see. All right, let's see what we can get here. Um, two is $7.03. All right, 703 to us and four units. Four is $12.99. And you can see at how it's getting cheaper, right? Uh, then we will do six units. Four, five, six is 1926. 19, uh, 19 to 26. And eight will be uh, 2583. So 25.83. So the way I want to do this is I want to push people away from buying just one. Do you know what I mean? I want them to be, uh, to, to be like, it's an irresistible offer. Like I want them to buy like four units. Usually that's the price I want to get to, you know, I want to get them to be buying more than that uh, then that, uh, that, that, that just that one unit. So sometimes I'll just price this first one like absurdly higher just so people don't, don't take that. So let's just see here. Let's just see some rough numbers. Um, ba, ba, ba. so for this product I would do, so if I'm doing 997 here, I would do something along the lines of 1497. Now work this to your advantage, guys. You want to push them off of this, but you still want to leave some profit. It's, it's honestly, it's even okay to break even here, believe it or not. If you follow this funnel format and you have the continuity pro program, the upsells, the order bumps, like you'll still make money. Like you'll just, we haven't gotten to step two yet, but um, $14.97 here, uh, $12.99. Let's see, what can we do? Uh, let's do $14.97 times two and we'll give them a better deal. That's $29.94. So let's give them a better deal, right? Let's do $24.94, right? We're giving deals, we're giving deals here. $24.97 for, uh, for that. Uh, let's do 14.97 times uh, times three, so we get our six price. That's 44. Uh, I would do probably even a better deal here because I want them buying more. I want them to be like, what the heck? Why why wouldn't I not got so many? Right. So I'll do 34.97 here. 
and then let's do uh, 14 whoops 14.97 times uh, what is it or oh, here's a four um, boop, boop, boop. so that is 59 and I will put these at uh, let's do I don't want to do 44 I'll do 46 97 uh, we could actually do like a crazy deal here because our margin allows for it. So thirty nine ninety seven for eight, right? That gives us over ten dollars profit here. Uh, this is a good. These are good markups right here as well. So the thing is, some of you might be thinking, well, Pete, nobody's gonna buy eight lures. They will test it. I promise you, test it. Do never, never, never think you know better than until the data tells you what what the what they want, what the market wants. Okay, let the data tell you where to look. So. That would be my order page. So let me quickly show you guys the order pages on ClickFunnels. So this was a challenge we did on this channel a while back where I sold these thin blue line stickers. But so I'm just going to give you guys this example of how these pages look like. So we don't have to build this all out and waste a bunch of time. But essentially, essentially, right? Instead of saying thin blue line sticker and these prices, I would do these, right? One unit is 405 or one unit is 997, 497, 2497. And I wouldn't do it as a free plus shipping here. Probably I would do it more like a big discount offer. Okay. You have to kind of t test both. Sometimes your, your audience will accept, uh, will be more accepted, uh, accepting of the free plus shipping offer, but it also depends on price. Like why would two fishing lures co uh, cost 1497, right? So uh, to ship. So usually I'd run this as a big discount offer. Now, next piece that I want to get from the offer, right, is what's our order bump, right? Order bump. Right now, the order bump is this little thing. It's an easy toss in, right? This thing right here, right? It just adds it to the order, right? Adds it to the order. Let me uh, make my screen a little smaller here so you guys can see it. You can see here was just some uh, some Police Lives Matter sticker for 997. Typically, I want something around that 997, 1297 range. Usually, I want this more expensive um, than the one unit. So you could see here I was charging 497 for one sticker. Uh, here I was charging 997. So I want this more expensive than the main product. So right here I'm gonna put whatever I sell. I want it to be 1497. Right, I want this to be $14.97, the order bump. So an order bump is easy tossing, right? It's like I got a grocery store. It's like before you check out, right? It's like a pack of gum or something. Just easy tossing, but like it's a no brainer. Usually this converts at 20% here for you. So let's go look what else can we sell here. So uh, ba -ba -bum. let me see, let me see, let me go down here. Usually they have some other stuff from the supplier that's complimentary. So boom, right here, you can see this one is actually 324 right here. And I actually, what I wanna do is I wanna give them a two pack. Yep, so I wanna do this. I wanna give them two of, of these, right? So, but I'm gonna give them uh, a two pack of this, uh, this style, right? It's a different style. It's 324 to us. Let's do a two pack to make it a little bit more exciting. And they'll ship together. So that shipping charge is actually going to be less. Um, it'll actually be uh, around 655, around that price. So order bump uh, is, is going to be a two pack of these different lures because they want more lures two pack. Um, that's going to cost us around, you know, I'll just even say 755 just for the sake of argument, uh, 755. And we're going to sell at 1497. And I'll bring this into view so you guys can see. So here's our order bump. It's a two pack uh, long lure, we'll call it. Um, 755 and we're gonna sell for 1497 which is again nice little double and uh, double uh, the price right there uh, which is per fantastic now again we would just plug that information into here right and again you could download this funnel down below there uh, and that would be our order page now to make these offers really pop okay Right, we're giving that everybody likes a great deal. I highly recommend the Sam Walton book. Um, um, Sam Walton's book, it's it's amazing. But everybody wants a good deal. But let's really put them over the edge to buy from us here, right? Let's really put them over the edge here. So what we want to do is we want to add information products, right? What sort of information could we give these fishermen with this fishing lure purchase that will get them excited, right? Like what what information? So. And this is free, right? This is low cost to you. You can just go get somebody on Fiverr to do this for you. So I like to go to eZine articles and I'll type in something like fishing. And look how many articles I get back, guys. Hundreds, 100,000 articles related to fishing. We're all related to fishing. Now, again, a lot of these aren't necessarily going to be for our customers. A lot of these might be uh, for like fly fishermen. Maybe we're not going after fly fisher. Uh, fish oil right here. So maybe we want to type in something a little bit. Uh, let's do uh, trout fishing. Whoops. 
trout fishing. Whoa. Computer's acting funny. Trout fishing. I think I spelled it wrong, but uh, nope. Trout, extreme trout fishing. Trout fishing tips and tricks to catch beautiful trout. America's top 10 trout fishing streams, right? The best time of year to fish for trout. What you want to do is you want to make these information products compelling, right? Like make them like kind of like uh, a little curiosity based, right? That's going to help them enhance their experience, right? And usually I like to have like two, uh, two products in here right so one for beginner one beginner product which might be like uh 10 tips to catch uh bigger bigger trout and two i want more for an advanced person that might be buying right somebody there's gonna be people that already know how to fish they already know how to catch bigger trout they, they just need other thing like so i might do something like five tips to um make your own fishing lure or something along those lines again you gotta l l learn the market see what they want here right so what i would do is i would go find articles here and i would just i wouldn't guess about it guys um oh boom this might be a, a, a more advanced one right here spin fishing for trout. three can't miss trout fishing techniques fantastic great curiosity made me stop um uh three ways to experience more trout fishing success these are fantastic these are great. So what I would do is I would compile all of these articles and create two, right? You could do this yourself inside of Google Docs, make it look nice. It's super simple. All you're trying to do is give information to your customer to enhance their experience with your product, or you can uh, collect as many of these articles as you can. Don't plagiarize, guys. Do not plagiarize. You want to make sure, sorry, the uh, camera's spazzing out. Um, you don't want to plagiarize this stuff. You can put it all together and, and uh, send it to somebody in Fiverr and they can do it for five bucks and compile things for you okay so um this is like similar stuff that i was teaching at ty lopez's house um when he invited me out there is really creating these better offers right creating these better offers to get your customers to buy from you so instead of just getting a fishing lure right they're gonna get so let's put this in between there because they have the option to buy the order bump or not right instead of just buying one fishing lure and it's leaving right they're gonna get oh they're gonna get the 10 tips to catch bigger trout they're gonna be getting the three ways to experience more trout fishing success um and it's really just understanding them another thing that i like to add in here is a facebook community group people love to hang out with other people that are like them guys you you need to have a facebook community a facebook group for your business it'll absolutely uh change the game for you so make sure you put in some sort of community into your um into your uh, your uh, into your offer here and this is an offer they can't get anywhere else right now we just crafted a very good offer right that people like they can't just go to amazon and get this they have to get it from us and there's so many cool things like what this is where the fun begins like crafting that good offer to get that person to buy from you like right away you know what i mean like this is how you win at this game this is how you beat all those shopify drop shippers and people that don't know their audience well enough to uh create something like this so what you can also do, um, let's let me uh, actually make this a little bit, um, whoops, a little bit smaller. So after you have your 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 order page done here, which is quick, we just basically did it all. Um, you could watch some videos on the channel. Make sure you check out that sales funnel masterclass down below, where we kind of walk through more of this in depth. Is we want to have upsells right now. Upsells are very 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 profitable because the person has already bought from you right they've already bought something from you and now they're going to be a lot more inclined to buy from you again so on the next upsell i love to sell them more of the same thing that they just bought right more of the same thing that they just bought so here you saw i was selling five more stickers but instead here i would sell all right after the order bump upsell number one i would sell them four more lures that they just bought on the order page at a better discount so here our cost is 12.99 right but we want to give them a better deal remember this is like all profit now right after obviously uh expense right here we want to offer them four more lures uh 12.99 is our cost so i would honestly give them this at like 1997 give them even a better deal than they just paid for that psychologically tells them be like wait i just paid more for this why would i not get this and give them a reason be like hey this makes a great gift for friends and family this is the perfect gift for the holidays the perfect gift for the fishermen in your life right like give them a reason to why they should buy more than one and this converts extremely well. Some of you might be thinking, no, wait, this, there's no way this will work. Try it. I promise you it will work for you. Okay. I've had so many students not think this will work, but it does. It works tremendously, tremendously well. 
Now, after you pick out your uh, your upsells, you can have as many of these as you want. Usually the first two upsells, I'll have them selling more of the same thing. But on upsell number two, right, which is right there, and they're the same page, it's the same exact page. That's why I'm saying this is so simple, so quick to get set up for yourself. Upsell number two, I'll sell them uh, two more lures. Instead of saying four, I'll give them two, and our two cost is 703. 703. So I might, I'll give them that at like 1297 now. I'll give them that at 1297 to give them a better deal to entice them. Now, here is where I would stop. That's it. And then just hit thank you page, right? So our funnel literally is four, five pages long, right? They hit our squeeze. So let me just run you guys through real quick how this would look like. So download this funnel down below and just plug in your pictures, right? It's so simple, right? It's as simple as it can be, right? So, right, they come to our squeeze page, right? And a squeeze page is just selling them on opting in, right? Send me my stickers now. And they opt in right here, right? Fantastic, right? We get that email lead. We can follow up with them with promotions. We could, we could sell them new things. If they abandon the cart, we could follow up with them for uh, cart abandon sequences. You can do this all inside ClickFunnels. You don't need any other apps whatsoever. All of this is on the base plan. You don't need Shopify. You don't need anything else. Just this, all right? order form right you just plug in your your information in here right put in your uh, your products put in your order bump right this is the next page they hit after they opt in this is where they put in their postage uh, and billing information after they click yes that they're gonna buy there right they hit that upsell they start going through the upsell sequences see they're very simple pages right yes upgrade my order or no this is how funnels why funnels convert at 10 15 20 30 percent i mean i've had students had that 80 percent conversion rate this is why they convert so well guys is because every step of the way is very simple it's yes or no questions yes or no questions there is no other buttons there's no special offers there's no banners there's no there's no confusion what they need to do next okay they just click yes upgrade my order and that is it and then we could put as many of these upsells here as possible and then we have our confirmation page here which is our thank you thank you order page and we just say hey your order will be shipped out within 72 business hours and we just give them a support and there's all these other cool hacks that you can add in here but i want you guys to be up and running making money as quickly as possible not thinking about anything else but you do have the option to push them to your shopify store here affiliate deals anything else but like guys like look how simple that is just plugging in your stuff now as far as traffic goes how do we start getting traffic to this offer right to get start getting traffic to this guys i personally reach out to Instagram, uh, Instagram and uh, YouTube influencers. And for the sake of this video, uh, go check out some of the resources on the uh on this channel there's so much uh instagram influencer uh, topics there's so many youtube influencer topic and if you want to really take this to the next level watch that training down below it's in the link in the first description guys like right there i kind of walk you through it's like an hour training and i have more time with you where we could talk about how we start sending traffic to these funnels but primarily what i would do is i would send that fishing lure to youtube influencers i would send that fishing lure to um uh, uh, YouTube influencers and Instagram influencers get it in their hands and get them promoting it right in some cases if everything goes well you can bring them on as your brand ambassadors right and build that business relationship right it's like a lost art a lot of people forget that like business is all about relationships so like help like give them as much as you can so they want to help you and, and work with you on your on your business to keep promoting your stuff and you just send them free fishing lures every month right that's what we used to always do is we would just send fishing lures to all of our influencers every single month and they would just use them and just tell tell their audience hey if you want to get these you can you could just go to this uh, link in profile and they would get a cut right so i hope that makes sense right and it's the easiest way to do it especially if you've never done like facebook ads or something like that before uh where you can lose a good amount of money if you don't don't know what you're doing that's why i highly recommend you utilize uh influencers to start testing your offer testing your funnels and making sure you get sales um guys i gotta cut this one a little bit short here i know um uh i wanted to go over a lot more but just uh, i got a call coming up here uh in a few minutes but if you have any questions whatsoever please drop a comment down below guys i get back to every single one of your questions and you'll also be entered in to win a 25 dollars amazon gift card and if you're brand new to e-commerce and you want to really understand what we're talking about here a little bit more especially if you've been struggling with shopify drop shipping or amazon Amazon FBA, just like I did, never was able to pay for myself from those businesses. Check out the link in the description, guys. The Sales Funnel Masterclass, it will absolutely open your eyes to sales funnels, these continuity programs, these subscription boxes that we can interweave in these funnels. And it's truly, it truly changed my life. It got me into ClickFunnels 2 Comma Club, and I know it can change yours as well. So if you got tremendous value from this video, smash that like button, smash that subscribe button, and have a fantastic rest of your day. And remember, your empire starts now.